We heard confirmation. Dragon SpaceX on the big loop, contact and soft capture complete. Attenuation in progress. And confirmation, soft capture and docking confirmed. That time, 4.37 p.m. Pacific, 11.37 GMT, with the International Space Station flying 261 statute miles over the Central Pacific Ocean. And there we got it. That's a gorgeous view. Now, of course, there are still a few steps that we have to complete before Dragon is securely attached to station. Dragon SpaceX on the big loop, soft capture ring retraction is in progress. There's our first full view of Dragon. Dragon Freedom attached to the International Space Station. Up next, we are uh, going to begin the hard capture sequence. That's essentially when we are engaging the hooks uh, around the docking mechanism. Well, unfortunately, we did have that video cut out right at that moment of docking, but it's great to see it attached now. Again, that initial contact at docking time, 4.37 p.m. Pacific, 11.37 GMT, the Dragon and Station flying 261 miles over the central part of the Pacific Ocean. And we heard the, the retraction of the docking ring is underway, so slowly see Dragon inch a little bit closer to the docking adapter, and then we can kick off uh, that hard capture sequence. All told, it'll take about 10 minutes um, for everything to finish after we've, excuse me, completed that, uh, that initial soft capture. Uh, we'll get those 12 uh, docking hooks engaged, uh, basically doing them two, at, two sets, uh, one set of six at a time, uh, after which we'll have a uh, hard mate, and then all of the post-docking configs can get put into work, including umbilicals, uh, and then the crews starting to step through uh, all of their post-docking, crew on board Dragon getting out of their suits, uh, and the crew on board station getting ready to go through the hatch operations.